Hello engineers, finally I got my base here complete and the entire setup is working as I want. I also made here a timer setup for a scriptless cycling for all, all ore types. But that's in only working with refinery number one for the setting. And here I got here the sorters for each ore type. Two of them are or better three of them are currently green. Because uh, because of the SDS mode here is a one one stand standard refinery and one refinery which is only for special for stone where I'm focused on power effectivity because when you make like a, a, a drill ring you can refine all the stone with better power efficiency this one here is special for cobalt. Maybe other players will think that different, but I, I very often get when I get a large pack of ores. What's mostly left behind is cobalt, because cobalt um, takes a bit longer and you have a lot of m more mass ore of cobalt and here we got the re special refinery for gold, platinum, uranium and magnesium they are also here set it by different sorters now we go here also here for ice, hydrogen and oxygen control stuff. But first we're gonna start here with our connected aqua tier. Three lines through the base. The blue one is for ice, the orange one is for components and supplies and ammo other stuff. And the black line is the entry line. For example, here I've got this is my component container. There are no steel plates. Now I'm gonna put here some steel plates. They are automatically sucked out. That over it's all over the sorters without script without script. Now they are here in my component container. Oh yeah, this is the, this feature here with the sensor of the light is uh, works over the SDSOS. So now we got here the SDS menu on the left, the large screen. That is my info screen where I show the different types of ores they got all different uh, efficiency and processing time the small LCDs there I can see the state of the sorters what that going over here I have here these ISNS is the current status that's for the first refinery only uses uh, iron, silicon, nickel and silver. In this mode the first refinery uses uh, iron, si silicon, nickel, silver, cobalt and stone. Now the stone and cobalt LCD turned red so I can to, so that I know 
refinery 2 and 3 are not in use. And there's also one for manual that also switches the LCD. The LCDs with the text and the color also controlled by SDSOS. But I will let these to IS and this part here. Because for the next part I have um, one setting for manual where I can set individual the sorter types activate or deactivate them where you see here stone gold is on no gold should not ah, this is from the, from the testing this should be the normal state the stone only this is um, the pre-sorter for the refinery <coughs> And here, this is yeah for the control for the first control part of the uh, of the sub program of the SDSOS. Where you see, of course, here the cobalt stone refineries are on. The refineries itself are turned off, but they took all ore. Now, when I turn them on. I can see them here, they are processing. And when I go here, this is start the sub program. Now the LCD switched, and uh, there I can see which ore is currently in refinery one processing. Now it's switched again. Net. Now it refines silicon. And also, here's another program. This is for the Ford refinery. I turn them on. Now it's uh, processing gold. Good, that stuff is working. But no. what the pro major problem was for set up this stuff is when you got here, this is a sorter. A sorter got thousand liters inventory. And that means no matter how you cannot um Set, uh, set the, uh, the sorter like only let 100 through 100 liters through so you have to handle with 2700 ores for every si uh, cycle step these informations I got from the uh, Space Engineers Wiki with uranium and gold. Mm, I'm pretty sure that uh, they are not correct anymore. There's been some change, something in the game. But for the, I uh, changed the times to a little bit smaller, so it that should work without an unnecessary pause. I see here this is um, the, the refinery for number four it's still processing it's working good I go gas works is off no, that's not this is for get the um, oxygen and hydrogen bolts, bo bottles in and out and the switch works over a timer block because with the SDSOS I only can, can uh, turn them on or off not not toggle 
that also in the other base or a refinery base they are made the, <coughs> the sorter blocks which um, goes to an exterior grid they are here one for ice one for components and supply they also switched over a menu point in the SDSOS and over this timer block Okay, no refineries. What? Yep. Good, it's working all. I want to see how much. Oh. In guts, do I got? We are currently nickel. Here we got the gold. Also, per for the extra refinery, cobalt and stone. Stone is pretty fast. Stone already done. Oh, no stone. Good. And mm -hmm. what I can show you is here. Yes, the SRS. Standard setup. And um, if you if you want to know how to set the, if you don't know how to set these stuff here, you can watch my other videos from the playlist. There I explain it in every point how to set the SDSOS. Yes, the menus. And here we got the um the sub program for cycling the also with the command write it's for the LCD where I can this is for clear and only these uh, red also here with text and background but also the bases on Steam Workshop you can download them there and check out all the settings by yourself and here is a point oh what I got silver here is a point which I set to zero because <coughs> the auto setup should only work with these not with cobalt and stone because I'm at there to different refineries I could change this year to a 9 so the script will not switch back to the start and go on to 9 10 11 and here is already the after cobalt the zero so that's also possible but that's nothing not I can't change that by a comment and this is a separate cycle this is for gold and for yeah, platinum ir uranium and magnesium no, no, no. and here are the settings for the sorters where I can set the sorter modes like the first one, like for manual, can switch them to manual and the, it's a very long command. In the mode manual, you can use them without the script over the timers blocks. And this is uh, for the other setting to use. Uh, refine without extra stone and cobalt refinery refining in a separate refinery mm -hmm. well, we'll take a look it's a small still running No. Got 
นั้นซิลซิลซิลโอเคทุกซัมซิลเวอร์ซิลเวอร์และซัมมัชเฟรสเตอร์I made it already. A few tests were um, for no reason. The refinery or the sorters don't push the ore, hmm. but that's only one time. And okay, that makes a, a little a little pause. Or is it too long? No, I think at this time um, I'm also not sure. If this is a good idea to run two programs, loop program loops at the same time, hmm. but I also can here and say now restart this. Iron is low. Okay, well I am. Now it's not uh, a little bit iron left to refine, but this, uh, if this uh, only, if you get only two types of iron, uh, uh, of ores, you need to change manually the cycle. And to stop the uh, the loops, that command is not. Possible to make over the menu. I got them. There's a little info screen on button number nine, where I can here press. Now uh, the program loops stopped. Okay, while well the LCDs uh, left at the point where they've been. But when I am now. Restart it. Just overrides it again, and switches will uh, again to the correct menu point. Good. That's all for this uh, video. Bye.